The Polyjuice Potion is a potion that allows one person to take the form of another and its ingredients are widely known by most Potter fans. But what was the reason for J.K. Rowling's inclusion of these ingredients in the makeup of the potion? Well, we're going to look at that today in the secret behind a Polyjuice Potion. Now I'm going to explain to you the reason behind J.K. Rowling's choice for each of the ingredients of the Polyjuice Potion and hopefully by the end of this video you can see just how much research J.K. Rowling actually puts into the development of not just the characters of Harry Potter but also the magical items and potions as well. Okay, so let's look at the six main ingredients. So we have Horn of Bicorn, Fluxweed, Knotgrass, Leeches, Lacewing Flies and Boomslang Skin. Now let's start with the Horn of Boycorn. So why is JK Rowling chose this as an ingredient? Well the Horn of Boycorn represents the idea of duality, a distinct connection between body and mind. Next up we'll look at the Lacewing Fly. So for what reason has JK Rowling included this in the Polyjuice Potion? Well the first part of the name, Lace, suggests an intertwining or a binding together of two identities, which is a perfect reason for a potion of that stature. Our next ingredient is leeches, so these blood sucking creatures inclusion in the polyjuice potion represent sucking the essence out of one person and into the other. Knotgrass is the next ingredient for the polyjuice potion, so for what reason has JK chosen knotgrass? Well, knotgrass becomes intertwined as it grows and it is included in the potion to represent the intertwining of two bodies. On to our next ingredient and that is Fluxweed. Now Fluxweed represents constant change and the mutability of the body as it's changed into another and this merits perfect choice for JK Rowling to choose this as one of the ingredients of the Polyjuice Potion. Now on to the final ingredient of the Polyjuice Potion and that is Boomslang Skin. Now the skin of the Boomslang represents the shedding of an outer body and the gaining of a new inner body. So everyone, I really hope this video has shown you just how much effort and research JK Rowling actually puts into creating content, not just about her big characters or her spells or certain scenarios within the books, but small things like a polyjuice potion, just how much research she puts into it. So everyone, with that being said, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed the video on the secret behind polyjuice potion. Now my question for you is... Tell me what video you want to see next. I'm going to put the choice in your hands. All you have to do is comment below a video idea and I will pick the one that I like the most. So comment below. Thanks.